packing. For Mexico. Anyways, good morning guys, it's Saturday and I don't have a tripod so I'm just balancing my camera on the dashboard. Maybe I should try to use my little mini one because I have one that's really small. Then at least I could record my workout. Obviously I can't work out, record my workout like this. Um, I'm thinking maybe I could go to Target and get one. Oh, mosquito in here. Get out, 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 out. Shit. Get out of here. It stormed last night, so it's very humid. Um, and the mosquitoes are, are, are out for reals. Um, anyways, I recorded a clip yesterday that I uh, just deleted because I looked ridiculous. I was trying to record while I was on my spin bike and I had my camera way too close to my face. I look like a weird floating head in the middle of the room. So I'm going to re-record it. I'm trying to remember exactly what I said. I did a little microderm abrasion on my face today. I'm trying to get rid of these goddamn zits, you guys. And I'm worried about my looming period. Like, at f when I initially calculated it, I wasn't going to get it till right when we came back from Mexico. And now I've been getting cramps for like the last couple days. But it could be ovulation cramps too. I don't know. Because usually I don't get cramps for three full days before the period actually comes. Sorry if guys that are watching this are grossed out, but you know what? It, it's life. <laughs> Women have to deal with this shit all the time, so you can at least listen to it. Anyways, so yeah, it could be ovulation cramps, possibly. I'm keeping my fingers crossed that it's that. Because when I woke up and weighed myself this morning, if I was actually getting my period, I would probably be like 10 pounds heavier than normal. <laughs> and my water count would be up. But instead, I supposedly hit my goal weight. And I'll insert my screenshot here, maybe, if I remember, um, of my little app that tells me. And I hit 136.4 this morning, so yay me. Um, and yeah, I ate, I didn't eat, oh, I didn't eat dinner last night, that's right, because I ate um, a half of a really rich, crazy hamburger at the Crafty Cow. Um, a li I had a couple of bites of Gia's mac and cheese, which was also really rich, and I had um, some of this amazing soft pretzel with cheese dip. So, obviously, I skipped dinner, and I did my spin bike right after that. Um, so, yeah, I, I was also supposed to do a photo shoot yesterday. We kind of spontaneously tried to plan something, John Lathrop and I. He's the guy I shoot with every year, bikini stuff. And we had a kind of a plan. It was, uh, in, it was hit or miss. Like, I had, I had forgotten at first that I had a client at 10 a.m. yesterday. Then she canceled, and we were trying to schedule it and plan it and whatever. And it didn't end up happening because he had to help somebody move. And then also it was thunderstorming and weird stuff was happening with the weather yesterday morning. So I guess it's good that we didn't try to do it. Um, oh, what else was I telling? I know that I had another story to tell you guys that I told you while I was riding my spin bike, but I can't quite remember it right now. I'm sure it was probably just talking about my period in the photo shoot. So <laughs> I will stop right here. And then I'll come back after my workout and let you guys know how it was. Alright, I'm here. Full body workout. Here I come. I almost forgot to do my wrap-up video, you guys. Greetings. I did a full body workout, um, a lot of hamstrings, although that probably wasn't a wise idea because my hamstrings are tight and they get sore, and I don't want to be sore on my plane ride Monday morning. Um, we're leaving tomorrow night. 
staying the night in Chicago because our flight leaves so early Monday morning. Um, so yeah, that's the plan. And I don't really want to be super duper sore on the plane. Um, I did squats, but not heavy ones. I did some high rows for back. I did some buys and tries and shoulders. So yeah, I hit it all. I did some weighted crunches for abs and I wore my little ab sweat deal belt thing. So I sweat my ass off. And then I went in the tanning bed after that for 10 minutes just to get a little bit of color on my legs and such. And so I don't burn my white ass in Mexico. Although I hear it's supposed to be freaking cloudy and rainy while we're there. I guess there's some sort of hurricane or something on the other side of the country. So it's after effects are leaving rain. Figures, huh? And here's where we are for my dad's birthday lunch. Point Burger Bar. Do you dance like you were dancing before? Yeah. What a cutie. Okay, you guys, we just had a nice lunch for my dad's birthday. And now, Jay and I are gonna stop at Target. Look at those sweet zit right here, you guys. Anyways, we're gonna stop at Target for some last minute things I need for my trip. And it is a nice 81 degrees. It's 81 degrees now, yay! Birthday, Grandpa! Happy birthday, Grandpa! I have old glam string knot. I have old glam string knot. I get the mimic. I can't 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 get the mimic. I can not get the mimic 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 i can not get
Um, and it protects against ticks too. Ticks are supposed to be really bad this year. This awesome bug spray. I had to unpack it from my um, suitcase because obviously I'm taking it to Mexico. Who knows what kind of crazy bugs they got down there. All right, barbecue is over. We are gonna go to Pick and Save and get some Twizzlers so I can have some Twizzlers for the plane ride. Um, and um, and what else do I need to do? Oh, and then I'm gonna go home and try and figure out how to download podcasts on my iPod because I have never done that before and I need to have something to listen to on the plane. So that's my plan, but I'm gonna end this here hopefully maybe upload this before I leave and then my next vlog will be Mexico so stay tuned thank you guys for watching and please subscribe thanks